I'm sure you've heard the term, the show must go on. And today, that is very true. Uh, I'm having a lovely bout with COVID. But like I said, the show must go on. And today, removing all of my Exodia pieces into this beautiful Millennium Binder that I got from Millennium Rares. <clears throat> and we get to put to uh, we get to put a pot of extravagance together. Pretty sure it's extravagance. As you can see, we have quite the assortment of Exodia pieces over here. And let's let's go through some of the completed sets real quick. Definitely have this uh, DLG one set. We got two heads actually. I think this set actually came from um, not Night Owl, Sage Killer. I believe I was on Sage Killer's whatnot and bought this whole set off of him. Beautiful. So we got one complete set there. We have a full set of QCRs. Almost another set of QCR. We are just missing the right leg. We are only missing the left arm and left leg out of the Korean set. We're missing four other pieces of the Starlight Battles of Legend Crystal Revenge set. And out of the Retro Pack 1 reprints, we are only missing the head. We are so close to finishing so many different sets of Exodia. This is one of the unlimited OG releases. Still missing the right arm and head there. And then the Legend of Blue Eyes reprint set, 25th. We got a right leg. You know, a fun secret incarnate. A first edition Legend of Blue Eyes right leg. We have a couple of alt art pieces. We have the left leg alt art. We have the right arm alt art. It's still in there. Packaging. And everybody's favorite, Maximum Gold El Dorado head. But yeah. Today we're just going to be moving all of my Exodia pieces to this lovely binder that I won on Millennium Rare's channel. Thank you boys. That was a fun wheel to take part in. And now my Exodia pieces have one place they can all just chill at. But yeah, wound up catching COVID this month, or this week, this past weekend. And um, thank goodness it's on my off days. But the show must go on. Can at least record some videos while I'm feeling under the weather. Oh man. All right, so that's nice and thick. Zippers, okay, let's see. That's cool as hell. Shiny, feels nice, I love the tooling. Feels like some nice suede on the inside. Oh no, hold on. Yo, we only got four spots. 
There's no way in hell Exodia can live in here. Okay, so what do we want to make this instead? Because I need at least five spots on a page to make Exodia's body. So, we're going to scrap that idea. Well, Exodia boys, sorry, hold on. We're going to have to think of a new... And y'all are going to wind up getting y'all's own... Freaking binder. Well then. If that's the case, we are going to save this binder for something else. And in the meantime, put our uh, pot of extravagance together, I believe. I forgot which wet not channel I won this off of. Night Owl, maybe? Ah, I can't remember. It's one of those late night purchases for sure. Extravagance from the pot collection. Now we just need to collect all the other figures and all of the cards. But to start, hmm, you can even put something in there. Nice. I don't know what the hell I was thinking. Uh, trying to make that four four card binder. Uh, an Exodia binder. That's funny. I didn't even think of it. So let's see. While I have these Exodia pieces out, can I get that ultra rare head to complete the retro pack Exodia set? Apparently a lot of the card prices in Retro Pack have crashed. Where um, Cyber Harpy Lady was 90 something dollars and now it's like 30 or 40. Hello, Beast Cold Dragon. An ultra, or a rare that I don't have yet, I believe. Today, upstart, and another penguin soldier. Plenty of those bad boys. Everybody's having a good day. We chilling with the with the plague as of right now. Yes, I have caught the COVID. Hey, well, there's a left arm. Not I need I need the head, guys. I need the head. Oof, three bears in a super out of that one retro pack box. That hurts.
But hey, you know what? I figured if I'm not feeling good, maybe opening up some uh, some cards for some dopamine might lessen the pain. Well, I mean, there's really no pain with this uh, bout of COVID outside of a little body soreness. My eyes hurt. It's weird. Hmm. Wall of Illusion. But you keep your upstarts and your thunder dragons. Hello, brother. Okay, well, I didn't get the ultra rare. Um. Exodia piece. I'll definitely take a Dark Magician. Yo, if we can grab a Blue Eyes and an Exodia head in these last last three packs, we'll call it a win. Ah, okay. So we got a Yuki pack. We got a Summon Skull with that. Not bad. Exodia. Up, oh, what, what? Oh, it's another left arm. <laughs> I was hoping, I was hoping I saw those stats and was like, oh, I don't know what the head stats are. Actually, let's take a look. What are the head stats? Oh, a thousand, a thousand. Okay. It is an effect monster in a thousand, a thousand attack. Got it. Well, well, we're going to have to find another home for the Exodia pieces. We will find uh, new inhabitants for the Millennium Binder. And, well, damn, we didn't get my Exodia head today. Got a couple more boxes. There's a lot more at Walmart, so... See you next time, guys, and hopefully I'm over this COVID bullshit. Later. <laughs>